John Grissom was an American novelist best known for his uh, American thriller stories that were fiction. Uh, he was born on February 8, 1955 in Arkansas. He was the second of three children. He had two other brothers, Mark and Kevin. His parents were Wanda and John. And whenever John was four, they moved to Mississippi. And John says his um, most important event in his life was whenever he turned to Christianity at the age of eight. Uh, growing up, John wanted to be an MLB uh, star, but at the age of 18, he decided not to because he wasn't good enough, and he went against a wild pitcher that actually targeted him. Uh, he went to three different colleges for accounting. He went to Northwest Mississippi Community College, Delta State University, and he finally graduated at MSU in 1977. Uh, later went to college to be a tax lawyer at University of Mississippi School of Law, but uh, shifted to general civil legislation and graduated in 1991. Uh, during all that, he also served as a Democrat in the Mississippi House of Representatives from 1984 to 1990. Uh, he married Renee Jones in May of 1981. And they have two kids together, Ty and Shea. Uh, and in 1984, he got his inspiration uh, for writing his first book whenever he overheard a court case of a 12-year-old girl uh, describing to the jury of how these two men uh, beat her and raped her, which gave him the idea of what would have happened if the father murdered the people who assaulted his daughter. Uh, uh, the book that he started writing from that took him three years to write while he still had a full-time job as a lawyer. Uh, he ended up publishing the book, uh, but it had been rejected 28 times until someone actually finally published it. Uh, they titled it A Time to Kill, and they published 5,000 5, copies at first, and then the next day after that got uh, published in June of 1989, he went and started writing his book, The Firm. Uh, he later sold the copyright for the film, and that actually got turned into a movie, which was one of his nine books that got turned into a movie. Uh, after that, John quit his full-time job as a lawyer and became a writer, but he did come back uh, one time to help a family who was who had a family member who had died. There was a railman brakesman, and he had died by getting crushed between two uh, railroad cars. He, uh, John ended up winning that case, and they won $683,500, which was the most money he had won in any of his cases. Uh, John still loved baseball, even though he decided not to play after the age of 18. He even spent $3.8 million on a youth baseball complex in 1996. Uh, John became well known and respected as an author from his novels, children's legal thrillers, short stories, nonfiction, featured films, Tovin series, and his fiction uh, thriller stories. Uh, he had published he has published one or two stories every year since the year of 1991, and he has over 300 million hardcover copies, uh, over 40 different languages, and nine of his books have been turned into movies. Here I actually have one of his books from 2010 called The Confession. Uh, I found it very interesting so far. It's been a good book. I highly recommend actually reading some of his books, and that's all I got for John Grissom.